Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your boy K9 Games, and y'all know I got the hoodie hood on. Y'all know we about to get deep. So I text this line the muscle sign. I saw it's gonna be nice to meet you. So um, a lot of you guys know one of the main things that I I talk about on my channel because this is like one of my main parts of my study when it comes to the whole mysticism and the spiritual world, and that is the dimensions, okay? Cause um, if you want me to be hundred percent honest to you, that's that's the structure to everything and and nothing as well. Like how that's if you want me to be honest with you, that's probably the core on everything. Because this is gonna be very important when it comes to opening up your mind and um, also understanding what the seventh dimension is. Because if you pay attention to any of my past videos when I talk about the dimensions, um, the seventh dimension has to do with that logic part of everything, literally. Yes, the seventh dimension is literally logic and understanding and the laws of the universe within itself. But you, like when it comes to what your brain works in our actual physical, non-physical reality, like it's all inter interconnected, even with your brain. But um, let's let's start off with a question just to make this this video fun, okay? So, my question for you, right, is can you double jump? Meaning, like, if you were standing in, in place, could you jump in the air and then jump again while you're in the air, right? For most people, no, they, they cannot do that because we have certain logical things in place, such as gravity and stuff like on that, which we can prove is the reason why we cannot do it. You understand what I mean? <laughs> And now the thing is, is let's say if the context was different, instead of you just being outside in our normal reality, let's say you were playing a video game and I was to ask you the same question exactly the same way I asked it, like, can you double jump, right? And in, the, and in that context, you will say, yes, you, you can double jump because in that reality or, or in that space, um, that logically makes sense, right? Now, if, if you understand what I'm saying, right? What I'm, what I'm basically saying is logic it's, itself, even looking at it from that simple point of view, lets you know that it's not only perception-based, but logic it's on self is um, also um, only quantified by the reality that the person is perceiving it through. So what I mean by that, right? It's like, um, let's say if I'm a PhD physicist and something like that, right? Um, and let's say if um, some, some other guy isn't. The um, way that we may look at certain things in reality is, is going to be different. Now, why is that an important? It's because when it comes to understanding certain higher dimensions and everything like that, um, you have to understand that you have to change your paradigm of thinking so that way you can expand the the logic because it's not the one thing is logical and one thing isn't and then so once you do that and everything um that will actually help you understand what that seven dimension structure is because if you if, if you think about it that is a part of our reality which um is let's just say it's it's constantly being relayed back back to us so that way we can navigate through reality. But a lot of people don't actually know what that thing, like what actually is logic and how can logic not only be a thing that we understand with our minds, but actually be a structure of our reality. Cause based off of my theories and my charts and everything, what I'm saying is the seven dimension, the same way we have logic in our mind, is literally the same thing that we're holding here. It's just a different property of this, okay? So it's kind of weird because it's, cause it's kind of like a, um, I mean, it's not kind of, it is a higher dimensional thing because the thing about dimensions and as a lot of y'all know is that they, 
they stack within and upon each other. So it's like if you were to look at this top from a one-dimensional perspective, right? You would you would just see the face, but but when you start adding in more dimensions, you get depth, and then you get more things packed in upon this one piece of void space that you see here. So that's how dimensions work. I mean, when you start going deeper and deeper or higher and higher, you're just basically pushing that limit of space and what you're perceiving in that space. That's all the dimensions are. And now when you get to the seven dimension, right? It's like, cause if you were to look at this, right? I kind of mess up with what I was saying. If I was to hold this in front of your um, face and then um, you were to um, see it and everything like that, but um, you were to to um close your close your eyes so that way you like reach like a like a ten dimensional prim perspective and you keep out all your um thoughts, but then you were to open up your um eyes and then you see like the color of it and you start getting all the all the thoughts and then all the logical things that come into your mind to what makes this what it what it is, that's the seven di dimension and you're seeing it play out within your own mind, but the but the thing is is all your mind is doing is relaying what what's already here like it's kind of it's it's, it's kind of interesting whenever you um, think about it because it's like it it helps you see like um the the dimensions are not as like how it's not as vague as you probably thought like how you can very much see like every single dimension which are which are on eyes you don't need a telescope for so i feel like that's uh one of the um greatest things about that but i hope that y'all en en enjoyed this video go on and leave me a like subscribe yeah you know what i'm saying i got some more books on on the way and stuff like that but um i've been focusing a lot also on like my my own business and um, my own personal life and everything like that too so um yeah stay on tuned y'all because um we've actually been finishing up with a lot of our um, business stuff and as that kicks off we're gonna be able to have a lot more time to focus on this mysticism stuff so y'all gonna um actually get a lot a lot more information um from this this side of things as we go deeper into the year but um also as my experiences increase too <laughs> but um yeah with all that being said i hope y'all really like this video like and subscribe like i like said show some love y'all know the paypal and the cash app y'all can donate send donations and show love but uh, yeah, keep making them connect games. I'm out.